Oh, cool, I can have about 15 minutes. Go ahead. What? Come on, keep going where you're going. Just drive. It doesn't matter that you lost the, the hood, dented up most of the car, and lost the right door. Just keep driving. <laughs> <laughs> and all all of the glass in, on the car. A real little bit of it. Yeah, I mean, there's the cars in that. Oh god, the front of the car. <laughs> oh cool, it even did. Is that supposed to be a stunt jump? Oh wait, no, you, you hit the camera. I think I I don't know which button to press for that. Oh, there it is. All right. <laughs> you gonna follow where the GPS is telling you to go? Where? The the purple line on the mini map is telling you to go that. Yeah, the other other direction. This way. Yeah, that way. In that general direction. Can it go slower? Is that one of the fast? Well, the 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 trigger is like a pedal. If you Floor it, the car is gonna go as fast as your as old friend. There's there's the car. Driving into the car is not going to make it move. Not especially not if you have the lighter car. It's better to drive on the road. It's better not to drive on into people. Remember what I said about drive trying to drive through cars? Did you forget about me telling you a reminder of not to drive through cars? Still, still, no, 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 that, no, that way, no, 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 wrong way, come on. It's like trying to get a really stupid dog to go the way you want it to. <laughs> You're got it. That, come on, that, that way, come on, go on. No, no, go straight, come on, on the, on the road. No, stop flipping the car, you're going to lose the left door now. It's only a convertible end, <laughs> there are only two doors. On, on the road, come on. Try, to, try to go on the road, there's a bridge there. <laughs> there goes the left door. <laughs> oh, I, I see part of, part of the front body... It, are you doing this on purpose, or I, I honestly can't tell if you know what you're doing? Turn around, turn, go, go left, go left. No, it's wrong. That the other left. That is not, it's not that way. You're, you're not, that's not the road. What's that? Anthony? Hearing some pew 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 in the background. That way. That way. Well, I I'd assume it's some. Do you think? I might have. Did you download that update? Hmm. House of Wolves comes out tomorrow. You know how to drive straight. Struggling? <laughs> Lighter car, remember? <laughs> that, that's a guardrail. You're going away from the road. Again. But I have to make the just go since the, um, I probably have the. I might have dissolves in there and negates in the sideboard. Um, I don't know what kind of draw power I'd have, but there's a. I'd probably have my Mantis Riders in there. It's a red, white, and blue three cast uh, creature with flying trample and haste, or it might have been flying vigilance and haste. I think it's vigilance. Um, three three. I'd have Seeker of the Way. Just. Hey, 
But um, that's at uh, take a right, and right back there. You need to take a right. You know how to stop. Turn around. Turn. Um, two two, white uh, creature with prowess. And when it uh, cast non creature spell, it get gains life link until end of turn. Um, I I might have the magma jets in there just for some burn. You know that two cast red instant two damage to creature player than scry two. I probably have omen speakers in there for the sake of because when it enters you scry two. That's a road. Dirt road. Have you seen dirt roads before? But, um, then Goblin Rabble Master is happening. I'm actually going to, I'm trying to get one out of a trade. Uh, Goblin Rabble Master is a very versatile, well, I won't say versatile, but it's pretty good. I don't even, what the fuck? <laughs> I don't even know how that happened. But, um, Rabble Master is three cast red creature, 2-2. Two, two. Uh, all your goblins, other goblins, have to attack each turn of Abel. Um, at the beginning. What? What about the road? You still got 1.6 miles to go to get to the location. I pointed out. What? I don't know how to follow the road. What two things? The bottom I'll just get. It's the same thing with when you're driving. Cause it's this is actually good practice for when you're driving. You get an idea of what the map looks like, and then try to put a picture into your head. So you see how that's got a straight line? You go straight, and then after, there's... Try to go straight. Try to go straight, there'll be a road on the left, but it'll also be a road on the left. Now keep going straight. No, what, what are you... Oh. <laughs> Anthony. She started backing up on the train tracks. I'm like, no, no, go straight. She turns the camera around. The train <laughs> runs the car over. <laughs> Surprise, bitch. I don't even know what's going on anymore. But, um, another thing about Rebel Master is being in combat, on your turn, um, you get a 1 1 goblin token for haste. The right turn. Okay, you have three left to make a right. You're going the wrong way again. And you, you, you start a barrel rolling again. But, um, the other thing, when Rabble Master attacks, it gets plus X plus zero. So, in the turn, where X is the number of attacking goblins, you, other attacking goblins you control. And the big reason why I, I see that combination that I want to do is because um, I just want to just see a bunch of those, and uh, including like Rabble Master, Seeker of the Way, and what's it called, uh, Mantis Rider. And you, he got a lot of creatures, and used uh, the Just Guy Charm to give all his creatures plus one plus one and life link. Almost killed his opponent in game like 20 life. Lifelink is a very powerful ability. The fun thing about Soren is his plus ability. It gives all your creatures plus one plus zero on lifelink until you your next turn. But even blockers get it. You know? Just make the right turn. You know how to turn right. Keep going straight, but start drifting right. And it's that one. Straight. Jesus Christ, Anthony, the wheels are tilted. <laughs> you need to watch this when I post it. What? Nobody, you know, is going to see it. It can't even drive straight anymore. Get back on the road. What are you playing? Oh, you're playing Destiny, right? Or are you playing a computer? Hellsword? Alright. But, um... I'm actually gonna speed up my abs and death a bit.
check out some of the lower cast creatures and the rundown of the creatures I'm going to have. I got a Dragonlord Dromoka. I got a Dromoka the Eternal because, uh, I mean, I'm probably might get taken out. You're going to drive right in the water. You don't want to do that. Um, I'm going to have four Siege Rhinos. You remember what that does, right? I have a four cast tricolor, four three trample, one enter the battlefield. Each opponent loses three life, and you gain three life. I'm gonna have four boon staters, which is a three cast green uh, two two or four two with flash and bestow. Um, I'm gonna have snares of the wild, which is a uh, two cast green two two with death touch, and the ferocious ability is when it's attacking a creature power four or greater. There's one of them. Um, it gets uh, plus one performance on the turn. Um, and I get some Anapenzas. And Anapenzas are foremost. It's a uh, three cast. Try color, you know, the Abzan color. Legendary 4-4. Four, four. And when it attacks, put a 1-1 one, one counter on another target half creature I control. Um, and if a creature would be put into the graveyard, exile it instead. Um, which is kind of nice. Um, also going to, I, probably, I think I'm taking out the secret delay that I had in there. Um, uh, yeah, I have the two rich shots of death dealers and the two police main lions. Um, I want, I need, I want to get some more collected companies. Those are pretty nice. You, uh, look at the top six cards in your, uh, Top six cards of your deck, you may put two creatures with converted mana cost, three or less, uh, on the battlefield to put the rest on the bottom of your deck in any order. And your Brave Sands. Oh, yeah, I was going to get two Wingmate Rocks. Wingmate Rock is a nice one. Um, five cast white creature with flying, has a raid ability. Raid is from the Mardu and Khans. Um, it, it's like ability to trigger if you attack this turn. The uh, Wingmate Rock's ability is if you attack the creature this turn, you get a 3-4 burn token with flying. And when Wing Wingmate Rock attacks, you get plus, uh, one life for each attacking creature. Um, yeah, it's pretty nice. What do you mean? I mean, I just spotted a point on the map that I wanted you to drive to. Why do you have things to do? It's water that way. vehicle. I already crashed my entity. <laughs> so, <laughs> it was completely accurate. No, it's just you can't drive it straight. Turn, turn. And now you need to swerve very hard to the left and you can't do it. They're not inverted. But um, yeah, a lot of the creatures, creatures of mine that would trigger, that would uh, show up from the collected company would be the Anapenza, the Arrow of the Wild, the Vansaders, the uh, Policeman Lion, the uh, Rishat the Death Dealers. I, I got a good good bit of creatures. There's like 14 that could be uh, picked up by that. I have one collected company. But and I got a good bit of creatures that would trigger the Arrow of the Wild ability being uh, Siege Rhino, Boon Seder, Anapenza. If I have Sor you know, if I have Soren out to give all my creatures plus one to zero on life links, um, the Wingmate Rock and the uh Nyx Boots, or not the Nyx Boots, the Police Main Lion. If I'm on Strauss with the Police Main Lion, it would trigger it. If I buff the Rakshas of Death Dealer with this ability, it would trigger it. Pretty much, as a matter of fact, oh hey look, you ran over some great, um, Pretty much every creature in my deck can trigger that ability. Can you 
drive on the road? Is that too complicated? Building. These things not occur to you? Do you see what Dad means when he said you need to play more games with her? Chris, you don't have to say it. Back on the road, it would take less than a minute to get there. You only made it worse. It's why to get back to the car to yell at them. How much you want to bet? Ask me on these videos, and I'm like, copyright, copyright, there's music on here.
there is a car in the way. You know the solution to that? Go around it. Yep, brute force. That's how you go around things. Go back to the truck and the truck. Dirt road. Go along the dirt road. Try not to hit that truck. I forgot what we were talking about. I could go ahead and tell you about another deck that I was thinking about making. It's pretty, uh, pretty good. It beat my deck. Then again, my deck is pretty slow. And with the help of what the guy showed me, uh, it's gonna be a lot, or not a lot, get a bit faster. Um, this is a mono red deck. And the, the nice thing about mono red or a monocolored deck over a tricolored deck. Is, I mean, it's a tricolor deck, you're going to want tricolor and dual color lands. So, for a monocolor deck, you use all basics. All of your lands are going to come untapped. And whatever land you get, you're going to be able to use for what you need. You know? Yeah, that's one of the things going. Is, at least, you know, is that all the mountains that are all blended together are going to come in untapped. But, um, this mono red, it used. Some burn spells, but it was like one of the quickest decks that I've seen standard. It used uh, Zergo Bell Strikers, that one cast red 2 2 legendary creature. Um, it used Monastery Swift Spears, one cast red uh, Jet Sky Creature, that was a uh, 1 2 haste prowess. Um, Lightning Berserker, which is a one cast 1 1 that has one cast dash ability and also has a one cast red ability to buff itself plus 1 plus 0 until the turn. Um, they had Goblin Rattle Masters. Um, I think what other creatures? Uh, I know it had Goblin Heal Cutters. I can explain that. It used, um, for the burn spell. I know it had, a uh, Lightning Strike. I understand. It, um, used Lightning Strike, a two-cast, uh, three damage to a creature player. Um, Stoke the Flames. Forecast uh, instant to burn four damage to a creature player, and it has a boat, which is really nice. Tap creatures, so planet. Um, it 
it used uh, arc lightning, which is like uh, flames of the firebrand, if you remember that. Chandra spell, three cast, three damage divided. Um, also use Fordling Outburst to put out a bunch of goblin tokens. Three, uh, three mana for three goblins, um, which will help out the goblin rival master. And um, Wild Slash, I think this is or at least in the sideboard. Um, you, yeah, I know you don't know what Goblin Field Cutter is, but it's actually really good, and I'm going the wrong way. And I'll go this way. Um, Goblin Field Cutter is a 4 cast red creature, it's a 3 2, I think. It's got a dash cost of 3, it's like a dash into 3. Do three damage, and whenever it attacks, target creature can't block this turn. Front flip. Woo! Oh god. Barrel roll. I'm rolling it. They see me. Oh. Oh god. Let's go up this dirt road. Yeah. <laughs> Can't stop it. Please try them. Mm. It's raining. Pretty hard. I'm gonna take my Xbox back upstairs. Uh, I'm done here. But uh, you know what Dragon Ball Reduce Tide does? Five cast white and blue dragon, five four with flying expert with one with untapped. That's the fun of using a chess guy ascendancy. I'm gonna cast a non creature thing, and well now he's untapped. And then, oh you tried to murder it with a kill spell. Oh by the way, that's expert now. <laughs> Nullifies the effect of the kill spell. But um and when you know, Dragon Lord each title's combat damage to a player, you uh, anticipate say you anticipate and anticipate a two cast blitz then but the, the fact is look at the top three cards of your deck but one in your hand and the rest of the bottom of your deck. Um that's you know, I, I say that because that's what you do when he deals combat damage. Just like when I say um when the DC exploits a creature you demonic tutor or diabolic tutor because that's what they do. The same effect. It makes sense to say that. There was also a creature, or not a creature, but a card that you guys said he'd be uh, up for trade, or one of those cards to throw on the trade, um, called Gross. It's a two cast red instant, deal five damage to target creature without flying. And um, that would be that deck's answer to a uh, Siege Rhino. Aside from, say, Goblin Heal Cutter. Oh, that's your only creature, by the way, it's not blocking any of my guys this turn. <laughs> But, um, the, you know, Siege Rhino has five toughness, so it doesn't have flying while I'm dealing five damage to right now. A good answer for another uh, Abzan deck or a blue black control would be this card that hadn't ever really occurred to me, and I've never seen anyone use it, but I'm actually going to get four of them and throw them in the sideboard. Anytime an opponent uses a black creature, I'm going to use it, because, you know, all multicolor creatures, if they're part black, they're considered black. They have black in the cast cost. Um, Dark Betrayal, one cast, black instant, destroy target black creature. Yeah. Oh, your Siege Rhino is, is part black. I'm, I'm just gonna murder it during your uh, instant for one mana. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Dear God, this car. <laughs> the front half went through a hurricane. Something of the sort. The car is the world. Yeah, my entity is. GTA physics, man. <laughs> that happened. You know what also happened before I went jump into an online session, a solo session? I went to single player and uh, started falling through the world. Uh, infinitely falling through the world. Uh, video game. <laughs> <laughs> And you know what?
pulling on a card that I actually like, or a few cards that I actually want to sell for.